Hey everyone, um, today I'm going to be uh, doing a uh, Photoshop tutorial. The weather's horrible outside and I can't ride, so um, the other day I photoshopped my car and uploaded it and then a couple people asked me to make a tutorial, so um, I'm going to be showing you how to lower your car and then tint it and then paint your wheels, I guess, because that's simple too. Very simple stuff, so here's the picture we're starting with. My car, super high, no tinted windows black wheels but we'll make them a different color I guess so you just open it with Photoshop of your choice and it's opening and you eat a Dorito so first things first I'm gonna make it a little bigger so you guys can see um, over here on the left you want to use your pen tool, pen tool, click it, this is for uh, lowering it and then for me it's command plus to zoom in so you can actually see your car. So I'm just going to start over here I guess and then you just outline your car. I'm not going to make it perfect because this is a tutorial and I don't want it to take super long but of course you'll be more exact with your points. You can use another tool to outline it, this is just the one I like to use. And then actually ignore that last point there. And then you will come all the way over to the side, go all the way up, go all the way over, go all the way down to your bumper, click, then click, then outline this. And of course mine isn't perfect because I'm not trying to make it perfect. And then connect your points. Make the selection. Okay. Let's zoom out. Okay, now this is where I always get confused, so hold on a second. So you have it selected and then you want to make a, a, a layer via copy then if you look at it it's this but then whenever I end up doing that it always ends up making it like that so right uh, delete that and then do a where is it because you want to do a select inverse there we go and then you want to layer via copy and then you got your car with no wheels and then you just arrow key down or oh, you gotta click on this thing up here the select tool and then select it and then you can use your arrow and stuff too make this visible again and then you can lower it however low you want it super super low or reasonable low I'm just gonna put mine right there perfect so you lowered your car that's part one next up we're going to uh, create a new layer select your brush tool make it black that's noise zoom into your windows and then you want to just outline your windows again I'm not going to make it perfect because this is just a tutorial and it's not supposed to be perfect of course when you're doing it you'll actually try to make it look nice. Perfect. Perfect, then we'll zoom out. And then you want to come over here to your opacity then change your opacity to where you want it that super dark tint super light tint we'll have mine right there um, to uh, do your wheels you would just do a new layer come on new layer 
same old thing. Um, let's select blue. Perfect. And then it's just the same old thing. We'll zoom in a little bit more here. I think I could do a rather large one. And of course it's not going to look perfect because I'm not trying to make it look perfect for you guys. Okay, but that right there is stupid. And we'll come over here for this wheel. Perfect. Definitely not the best choice of colors. And then you do the whole opacity thing. Of course my wheels are black so it doesn't work as much. You can also mess with this fill thing as well over here on the right just below opacity and then you can change the color that way. And of course that's not a good choice of colors but it doesn't really matter. So you have that and then uh, where's the uh, original to compare them to. And uh, that's just a quick and easy how you do it. Hope you enjoyed the video. Um, it's just something different. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next video when it's uh, nice out and I can ride. See ya.